Hello boys and girls, chipmunks and squirrels, this is Bone Fox back with you, And this is another episode of the Hashtag YouTube Project that was created by Tear Wolf, which I have finally found out what the pronunciation of his name is. Go me. <laughs> Sorry about that, dude. I really had no idea what the enunciation of your name was. But in this week's episode, Tear Wolf has challenged us about what was our worst video. Now, there are several different ways that you could go over this, but I think for most YouTubers, we just use the dislike button to judge which video has done the poorest. Now, I really don't necessarily use that, but that's only because I only have one video that's received a dislike. I have gotten likes before, I've gotten comments. Not very many comments, but I get comments and likes quite often. I do not get dislikes, though. So, I don't know if that's just because my videos are good enough that they're not uh, worth disliking, but not necessarily just, like, outstanding. Or what's up with that? Because I figure I should receive at least a few dislikes for the number of videos that I have out. But the one that I do have is actually the second episode of Unturned. Now... Generally, I don't watch my own videos beyond the uh, actual creating of the video process, such as the editing to make sure the sound quality comes out right. But with uh, this one, I actually did have to go back and rewatch it on YouTube, so my number on that one is mildly skewed. It's one higher than it actually should be, because I went back and watched over it to see what it is that might have garnered that dislike. And I can honestly say from watching it myself, I think what really did uh, that one injustice is I did not actually hold a very good conversation. Yes, I was playing with a friend, so generally you'd think that that would increase the odds of there being a good conversation. But in this case, it actually failed quite miserably. We talked, but we did not hold a just a, a spectacular uh, conversation or even a continual conversation for that matter. Uh, I think that is mostly due to I was... I had fallen into the survivor game mode where I'm trying to gather up as much data as I can as fast as I possibly can, which means I kind of lose interest in what else is going on around me. And so I really didn't talk as much as I should have, I didn't go over things as much as I should. So I think that is why my uh, actual conversational skills during that one were so bad. Were so bad. But I mean, that is in the past. And I haven't received a dislike since. Now, that could just be that the people that watch watching my stuff just really like my stuff and therefore don't dislike me, and I don't get that many random people. But I know I do get quite a few random people on, say, my Primal Carnages, and... Because I know like 90% of them are from Russia and Czechoslovakia, actually. Which is really cool to actually think that I'm garnering attention from countries that far away. And to all those from those countries that are watching these, you have my gratitude. Thank you for watching, and I hope you all continue to enjoy my videos for quite some time to come. But, as for the other way that I would judge my uh, vi whether my videos were liked or disliked, is purely off the view counts. Now, if I'm going off of which one is disliked the most using view count, uh, I have way too many to pick up. Because I have noticed that my uh, major league title games that I play occasionally are probably the ones that get the least amount of views. Such as, I did Borderlands, and the first couple did okay, but then just dropped off hard. Didn't receive any views on like the last 10 so I ended up just stopping that series altogether to avoid having a, a useless series going on. Because apparently no one was really enjoying it. So I mean, I if, you were not, if you're not enjoying it, I'm going to put something out that I think that you will enjoy. And my indie games seem to garner uh, more attention so than my AAA titles. Because the same held true for Shadow of Mordor. Now, with Shadow of Mordor, I'm not really surprised, considering the fact that when that game came out, the market was saturated with people doing that game. But it was an amazing game, so I can't blame any of them. But I think because of that, having a uh, lower-end YouTuber like me 
coming in and playing that game, just really no one was interested in seeing anyone other than like, I don't know, Northern Lion, Milby, or some other major league gamer actually playing it. And I understand that completely. So I have stuck away from more uh, mainstream titles. Now, Alice in Wonderland, I guess, technically constitutes as a mainstream title, but it is a really old mainstream title. I also did ner did a lot of Darkness 2, but it fell into the same category as the other two did, where it died off hard for some reason, and I'm not sure why that was. But it did, it just dropped off spectacularly towards one end. So I ended up quitting that one, though I was really enjoying that series altogether. But what, are, what can you do about it? It is what it is. Um, so that is one of the reasons that I'm always asking my fans for video games that they suggest. Video games they want to see me play. That way you guys can see what you want. And I'm not sitting there playing guess which random game they might enjoy. Now don't get me wrong, the random games such as like Hand of Fate, um, this game here actually is a pretty fun game, but it's not a game that I'd do a series over, because none of the uh, games are more than about 15 minutes at maximum. But most of them are only about 2 minutes. As you guys can see from these footages, I actually went and did a whole bunch of these really quick and just kind of tied them together for this, because I still can't get OBS to actually record my camera and not turn it all green and funky. But... I would have to say, I think Borderlands 2 is probably my least enjoyed videos that I've released, even though Unturned, the second episode, was probably the one that, it was the only one that I've gotten that actually has a uh, negative comment on it, or not a negative comment. I've actually received no negative comments, uh, but it's the only one that's received a true dislike. But anyways, this is Bonefox saying, please check out the other people taking part in the hashtag YouTube project. This including Tier Wolf, Digital Addiction, and any of the others that I don't actually know the name to, because I mean, there are a lot of us actually doing this. I'm not sure how many though, but I mean, check them out, leave likes, leave comments, tell them Bonefox sent you, and I'll catch you all later. Oh, also, I have released a new series called Lichdom. Check it out if you have time. We'll talk to you later. Peace out.